Hey guys, welcome back to more My Hero Academia reactions. So in the last episode, the students all went on their internships. Um, what's it called? Deku is gonna meet All Might, or he actually met right last episode. Yeah, they on met. The, um, um, end credit. End credits, yeah. right? They he met All Might's former teacher. Grand was, Torino. Yeah, Grand Torino is his name. He was All Might's teacher when he was in uh, UA. UA. He's not his predecessor, but he was friends with his predecessor, so he knows yeah. how. Um, he knows about um, the quirk one and for how, all. one for all and how it works. He looks like an old Teen Titans Go, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> he does. Like I could see it. Yeah. I could definitely see it. Um, I'm really excited to see what Gran Torino is going to teach Deku and what all these students are going to learn from their internships. So with that being said, let's get on with my hero. Now, who did you say you were? I'm Izuku Midoriya from UA High School. You're who knows? I'm Izuku <laughs> So what's your name, boy? <laughs> <laughs> he was all my teacher, so I knew he had to be pretty old, but I didn't expect him to be bonkers. <laughs> Bonkers. I could really. Toshinori? Midoriya! Excuse me. I just need to make a phone call. <laughs> Am I in the right place? <laughs> oh shit. Why don't you fire off a one for all smash at me? Oh! oh. I want to know how far you've come in terms of handling its power. Straight to the point. Where's that attack? But, sir. Hey, what are you doing here? Does he what have the fuck is happening? Oh, oh shit. shit. When he's serious, he's pretty yeah. serious. It's time for you to show me what you can do, you newbie. <laughs> so was his like is that an Alzheimer's act? thing an act? He may be the symbol of peace and the number one hero, but All Might's a total novice when it comes to teaching. Mm. Oh, oh calling All Might out. This will be my first battle in the new version of my mom's suit. It looks oh, much better. Yeah. It looks a lot sturdier. Yeah. yeah. Not uh, flimsy. I like the addition of that thing on his neck. Mm -hmm. It's sort of like the... the the teeth that All Might has, but it's not like from the original version of his suit. I can't believe you're the ninth holder of this great power. Nine. Taught you anything. Damn, for an old guy, he is fast. Right? Imagine him in his prime. Yeah. He's not giving me any openings. He's passed behind me twice. That means there. Clever analysis, newbie. Ooh, he saw that coming. But your admiration for All Might and sense of loyalty to him are shackles on you. Mm. Meanwhile, I'll go buy us some grub. Clean this place up while I'm gone. <laughs> Do some chores. That's what interns are for. It's possible this is the only way he'll learn anything. He needs to think about the ways he must grow. How he can mature. Oh, his mentor is gonna be Stain? That's interesting. Just like the UA students have their internship. Yeah. The villains are going through their own. Mm -hmm. Do you have a fatal flaw? You believe you're the best, and you display that belief without regard for how it reflects on you or your image. Yeah, he doesn't give a shit. Don't tell me you brought me here just to give me a lecture. Oh, oh wow. I have to correct people. What in the hell are you doing? Isn't it obvious? I'm educating you on becoming an exemplary pro. Mm. That includes being aware Educate of him. Your appearance. Someone your has emotions. to. It's long overdue. There are count one week. I will stitch these things into the fabric of your being. Good. Wow. I'm excited for that. Tetsu, Tetsu, Ha! Of course they're in the same place. Of course they're together. Arguments about this when the world of Ooh, hello! For example, oh, of course. Oh, I'm not girls. surprised. Do you know why I chose to recruit you two? Because they're pretty. You're both very cute young ladies. What did I say? Just their looks. It matches Momo, were, Momo was disappointing in the tournament. Yeah. And yeah, it matches with the lady. 
finally ready to walk down the path of the mighty. I have no intention. Of oh my God! Really? He chose his dad? Why the hell did he choose his father? Oh, yeah. Uh, Ooh. Ah! Fit. Trial, well, trial and error. Yeah. Of course he's not gonna get it on the first try. Of course, I suppose All Might can't wrap his mind around that. He was pretty much able to use one for all right off the bat, so I told him. Oh, shit. Sure. He was entrusted to me by a sworn friend who had just passed away. Oh, Duh. oh predecessor. his predecessor. So, can you tell me anything yeah. about the guy? A microwave? Yeah. Omozon? <laughs> yeah. Omozon. Omozon. Parody of Amazon. So, what you, you stuck a huge plate in there, didn't you? If you do that, there's no room for it to turn, so only one part of it gets hot. Have you never done this before? Oh, I'm sorry that. That's gonna help him. Yeah, I knew yeah. it. I fucking knew it. Got it. Imagining the energy that used to be focused in one place and focus it all over his body, just like the microwave. Didn't take him long to figure that out. Oh, he wanted oh. him to figure it out that way. Searching through all the hey, has an X. Yeah, we've seen that in the intros. And can you move in this state? I don't know for sure. About to find out. I enjoyed this episode. Yeah, this episode was very informative. Mm -hmm. Mostly it revolved around Deku's quirk. Yeah. The one for all. Learning Trying about. Trying to figure that out. Yeah, learning more about it. Learning more yeah. about what this whole thing means. And mm -hmm. Deku was saying, like, well, Gran Torino kind of told him that his admiration for All Might is like shackles. Mm -hmm. And like we, you were saying, it's it's the fact that he's trying to please him because he looks up to All Might that way. But in reality, he was summoning it like it's some special thing. Mm -hmm. But when he's supposed to just have it available, he's supposed to not turn it off. And like spread it and throughout spread his it body. Through, yeah. Not just like concentrate Focus it, it in on one, one area. And that's probably why his, That's why he's getting hurt. He, that's why his his bones are breaking. Yeah. Cause all that power is surging in one area. It's not getting it's spread. not getting it's not evened out. That's why yeah. he's hurting himself. Because when you impact something with so much power, it's gonna break. Cause it has no control. You're not spread. You're not, not evening out yeah, the pressure. Yeah, and like we were saying too. So Gran Torino is gonna teach him in this way. Mm -hmm. He's gonna guide him in a, in a certain fact where it's using Deku's analytic skills to be able to help Deku realize for himself what he's doing. Yeah, and he was saying that too. That All Might just because like he's the number one hero, just because like he's symbol of peace doesn't necessarily mean he's a great teacher mm -hmm. and you kind of see that with you know the way Gran Torino is teaching Deku and for and like All Might didn't really struggle with the one for all quirk. yeah Torino said like he was a natural at mm -hmm. it you know he got it in one shot yeah so you and can't expect him to teach someone that's struggling with it yeah that's true and what it is too is um All Might also already had the body Deku, on the, on the other hand, had to be able to get it to be even one hair ready for it. You know, and Deku's still growing and getting that body, getting his body ready for the quirk to be able to handle what it takes. Yeah. And you see how much, like, he kind of bulked up when he kind of, sp when he spread the power. Going to Gran Torino, I thought at first was like, what the hell? Because it's Alzheimer's? <laughs> like, I think that was just a fright. Yeah. No, it's just no. for comedic purpose because you know how All Might also has like that funny side, yeah. So it's very similar with Torino, like mm -hmm. Deku said, they have their serious side and then they have their comedy side. Mm -hmm. And it seems like what it was is that not only is was Gran Torino All Might's teacher in school, is he's the one who trained him, mm -hmm. like his predecessor didn't really train him. Yeah. Because his predecessor passed early. Dude, is All Might gonna Is die? that the case with All Might? Is All Might next? Right? Like, what the fuck, dude? It's gonna be so sad. I know, and then they were saying that too, that yeah, sure, like time waits for nobody, but it, does that mean, like, does that really mean that All Might's really gonna die soon? 
We also found out that Deku is the ninth. Ninth, user. yeah. Ninth. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because uh, All Might is eight, and then mm-hmm. his predecessor was seven. I want to know more about the predecessors. Like, how they were able to handle it, especially like the one who gave it to All Might. And I want to see All Might too, like when he was in school and in his prime. Mm-hmm. Like when he was still healthy and everything for the massive injury. I hope Grand Trainer will give us like that, like how he was able to train him, what All Might kind of struggled in, what he was good at. Uh, Torino and Deku relationship reminds me of like Karate Kid. Mm. You know that elder mm-hmm. um, teacher, mentor that's like teaching the yeah like a very young student very like the, young yeah like the upcoming generation yeah and then we also got to see the other students um internships mm-hmm. i like bakugo and the gene guy yes because like he understands bakugo's attitude yes and he's gonna he's educate gonna him fix it yeah like he's gonna drag him from his high horse and like mm-hmm. put him on the ground like like i love bakugo as a character yeah you know we love him as a character but it's just like there is that whole attitude issue that he has that mm-hmm. needs to be like put in place yeah because while he's great while he's an excellent student you know that's still a flaw of his. that's still a flaw is his attitude yeah like while he like there are a lot of things that are good about Bakugo, like how he can use his quirk and whatnot, but his attitude is a problem and it's mm-hmm. not good for his image as a hero. And like, I feel like this hero that he's interning with will teach him that like your image really does matter when you're a hero. Mm-hmm. Cause you can't get people to let, you can't get the public to trust you if you have that attitude problem. Cause I've been waiting for that character to kind of like teach I honestly Bakugo. thought it was gonna be Aizawa. Yeah, same, but it's not. It's this guy. Mm-hmm. You know? Cause I've been wanting Bakugo to like humble himself a little. Mm-hmm. So I can't wait to see like everybody in their internships and what's gonna happen. Especially too that the villains have their own little mentorship thing going on too. Yeah. Stain is pretty much um, the the hand dudes. the hand dudes uh, internship mentor. mentor. Yeah, pretty much, you know. Which I thought was pretty cool because our heroes are dealing with that, and mm-hmm. so are the villains. Mm-hmm. So, anyways, what did you guys think of this episode? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. I'm Ray. I'm Danny, and we'll see you in the next video.